is um, the Chinese character names of everyone in my family. La Ying Chong Sun, which is me, and Kyu. And this is my dad's seal because he's a, he's a Chinese calligrapher. And uh, he wrote those out on a piece of paper on a wall in the big, with a paintbrush. Very small, actually. And when I went to Toronto, Ontario, and Canada, um, that's where I got my first tattoo. I was, I was 25 when I got that. Um, yeah. And then when I had my first son, well, my only son, uh, my first one I got is this one over here. This is... Uh, it means fly. It's Faye. It's the name of my son's name. Um, this one, my dad also wrote on a, he wrote on a, on a big, on a, like a scroll of uh, rice paper. He wrote it with a huge brush, like the brush was big. And uh, he wrote it out for me with a stamp. And that's, yeah, that's the seal. Now, okay, now go back with my first tattoo, the one with my family people's names. I, I don't know where, I don't remember where I got it from. I don't remember who I got it from, it's just the local one that was in Toronto when I was there for uh, ad school. Um, but when I got this one with my, uh, my my son's name, I got it off uh, the place in um, Vancouver. Monkey King was the name. Um, he was my friend's um, nephew, well my friend's boyfriend's nephew. But he ended up being like this big time guy, so yeah, really like his work, so he got that. And then after that, I got this one over here, which is my daughter's name, uh, Gil, and that's my dad's seal. So yeah, you know, same thing, just on the other forearm, um, Chinese character, that's on my arms, and you know, for me, it's just everything I do. I try to raise them, I try to take care of them, and I have my, these two hands to do it, and my, my arms to do it. Cheesy, I know. And then I have one over here, which is um, koi fish. And I got this one done by the same guy, Monkey King. This my one, this one here, and then my, uh, sure, it's a big koi fish. My dad is also a painter, among the many things that he does. And he um, does uh, koi fish drawings, actually lots of fish, different types of fish, but just Asian style uh, watercolors. And I've always liked koi. And growing up, uh, my dad raised koi fish as well in this little aquarium that he built uh, in our backyard. And he had lots of fish. And when I was born, um, my dad told me that I've always had koi fish in my life. But I forget how old I was. But um, it was at a point when I was 20 years old. And the koi fish that was in the pond was 21 years old. Um, anyways, I've always liked that fish. So I wanted a koi fish on my arm. I want him swimming upwards, because you know what I mean, you gotta do hard work. Jeez. <laughs> yeah, so this one is uh, my other one. And that's it. I'm hoping to get some more ink done uh, next time I go to Poland. Um, I'm gonna get some artwork done there. There's very, very nice, very nice artist. A uh, very talented artist that can do his real life stuff. So I'm, I'm looking to do a kraken, like a big octopus type thing. Kind of haven't decided yet, but that's so for what I'm planning to do, like a really mean one on my back of my calf. I'm thinking about doing that. 